Hey guys, I want to get on today and um, some of you that follow me on social media like Facebook or Instagram or any other, you know now that my Molly passed away. I'm trying to get through this, but I felt compelled to get on and tell you why I haven't done some videos in the last few days. Um, <clears throat> Molly got sick. Uh, she'd been sick off and on, and then she she would get better. But I don't think that had anything to do with what she finally died of eventually. Um, she had kidney failure and pancreatitis. Um, Molly, as you know, was uh, um, sick. Those that follow me know that she was 16 years, 9 months old. I'd had her 16 and a half years. Um, this coming October, she would have been 17. We are so blessed to have her. She was just a bundle of joy. Um, best personality. Loved everybody. Kind. Uh, if you can call a dog kind, she was. She always wanted to please me. She was a lap dog. I always said, be careful what you wish for. Um, I did a video on her a while back, and I'll try to link that if I don't find out on this video. I will at one point or another. This is a, just a really quick video, as quick as I can do, to just let you know to keep us in your thoughts and prayers. She was... Um, my little companion, my little best friend. Um, one of our clients told us something, and I, 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 I want to share it with you. There's three things when you lose someone: if it's a person, or if it's, uh, or if it's an animal. This is the three things you need to do. And I got to thinking about that. I need to get back to, even though this happened just Wednesday, I need to get back as busy as possible. First thing you should remember of the three things is something to do. You always need something to do. You've got to keep your mind busy. You've got to keep busy. I noticed I was walking around in our home and from one room to another and thinking about things, thinking about what her, thinking about the, her end of her life, all that. But you have to keep your mind busy, something to do. Second of all, you have to have someone to love. If that's a child or if that's a, um, um, a partner or a girlfriend, boyfriend, uh, someone to love. Just love someone because everybody needs to be loved. And you know that, that animal, if it's a cat or dog or whatever it is, they gave you unconditional love. But you need to have someone to love. And you, you will have someone in your life, a friend, anyone. Just someone to love, someone to listen to you, someone that loves you. The third thing is something to look forward to something to look forward to that looking forward to a, a trip or someone coming by or someone coming to have dinner with you or so, something to look forward to every day and i think this happens in everybody this these three things are good for anybody anytime if you don't lose anybody but you have to have these three things i don't want to get myself where i am so you know me, I love life. I love I love being um, with people, and I love people. And I don't want my sadness, I don't want that to come across, uh, even though I am sad. And it's okay to be sad, and it's okay to mourn. I understand that. I know it's okay for me to cry. I know it's okay for me to say, I want my Molly. It's okay. I understand that. But I can't let myself, or any of you, if you've lost a... A, a child or anything because Molly was like a child to me and if you've not had a if you if you never had an animal that you love that much you do I, I you would not understand this but when you love a, a, a animal of some sort and you love them unconditionally and they're part of your life you are going to mourn you are going to mourn if you if you have any compassion at all in your in your life and I I, I I think most people are that way. But anyway, that being said, I wanted to get on and tell you those three things and tell you about her, her passing that keep me and my husband in your prayers because it's, it's very hard right now because, as you know, she's been in a lot of my videos and she was a part of my, big part of my life. 
You have a great day. Be happy. Be kind. Be kinder than they are. And don't forget to give a smile. If you do, you might get one back. I love you. Until tomorrow.